fall flower show isn't the only thing happening at Phipps this season. They've just opened this year's edition of the Garden Railroad. Boaz is there to give us a sneak peek of the incredibly detailed train display. And every year they have a new creative theme. So what is it this year, Boaz? Hollywood, da, 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 Hollywood. It's sort of a movie magic theme. And I'm here with the designer herself, Mary Lou, who came up with this incredible idea. Right now we're standing in front of the Phipps movie studio back lot. So can you can you introduce us to this year's okay. Garden Railroad? Welcome to the Phipps Movie <laughs> Studio. This one's a lot of fun. There's a lot of whimsy in this one. And this one, the interactive Hollywood lights up for you. People talking, oh, yeah. lights. Go. Oh, wow. And so you've got the whole back lot going we on. Have They're the filming some lock. sort of British scene over here. Exactly. It looks like a, filming a sequel we to have Mary our Poppins. prop shop over there. Oh, wow. We have lights spinning. And each sort of area is a different movie That's sort right. of genre. So let's keep going over there because I okay. see a pirate ship ahead. This is almost a little maybe Pirates of the Caribbean inspired. Sort of feel. Yeah, this is Whipcord Cove, named after the whipcords in here. And in this scenario, we have pirates who have taken over the ship and they're taking their gold and they're oh. hiding it in their castle. And if you haven't been here before to one of these garden railroads, they always have these interactive components. So you just wave your hand here and then there's a little pirate ship that, that starts going back and forth over there, which is so cool. And it's crazy because every year you see you're like, oh, the garden railroad's back, but it's completely different from last it year. Is. It's like there was not a lake here last year. There was not a like a hill and mountain over there last year. This yeah. is completely different. So you have to start from scratch. When do you start planning this? We start about a year out and it's a big team effort. Yeah. When we come up with the idea, we figure out how all the interactives are going to work, what the landscape's going to look like, the plant palette, everything to make it a really interesting and fun it's show. such diverse plants. You said there are hundreds of plants here and hundreds I want to walk down here because here. here we're in the sort of tropical exactly. pirate zone, but then we're heading down here and we're going into this desert Western town. Yes. Uh, there's cactuses. And I, I imagine there's tumbleweed blowing through here. This is always a favorite because people love the little cactuses. They really yeah. give it a good s scale for it, and it's such a contrast from the fantasy that's so lush. Yeah, and it's such like a classic genre. It is. It is. And, and coming over here, I, I see. I think Godzilla over here. That's right. And this is everyone's favorite. Godzilla <laughs> is battling the lantern flies for us. Oh my gosh. The spotted lantern the fly. The spotted lantern fly. And so are you fabricating all these little houses? We have volunteers come in and they construct all these houses for us or repair them or do different touch-ups to them for us. Yeah, because obviously you haven't had Godzilla here before, so this is sort of a new scene. And I want right. to point out, this we've is got a, a very little KDK news vehicle over here. How this cool is very is that? special, yes. So they're covering the attack on the city of Phipzilla attacking the lanternfly, trying to keep everything at bay and saving the city. And another interactive element I love that you do every year is you hide something. And, we do, And yeah. so what are you hiding in the scenes this year? Since it's a movie set, we have to hide an Academy Award. Okay, so you're looking for a tiny Oscar yep, Award. Yep, yep. We have a sign here so you can get an idea of what scale you're looking at. And I, you know what, I, can you even hear me in the studio? Because I looked over there and it looks like the KDKA tower has fallen down. So I'm not even sure, can you hear us over there? <laughs> I can see it, yeah. <laughs> Loud and clear. You know what, Boaz, it's so funny because someone, one of our former studio crew members here, Marie, who just retired not too long ago, she sent me a picture of this. She went to see the Fall Flower Show and she was like, you're never going to believe what they have there. That is so good. That's when you know you've made it, when you show up in the fifth display. Fall Flower Show. Yes. I, <laughs> I love it. Very cool stuff, Boaz. Thanks for showing us around. There goes the train. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Yeah, you got to come down here. It's my favorite. It's really cool. Okay. That is amazing that it's all around us. The spotted spot lantern fly. Kill that. Kill it. I, they keep coming back. That's all the problem the with them. The Garden Railroad is now on display at Phipps Conservatory and Botanical Gardens. Those tiny trains will be running during regular hours through early March. We've got all the information on our website. We'll be right back after this.